For more than eight hours a day, Sergei Richter stares through a gun sight and fires endless bullets at a tiny bullseye far off in the distance. The 22-year-old is among the top sharp shooters in the world and one of Israel's best hopes for a medal in the upcoming London Olympics. For years, he's also been taking aim at a far more difficult target, raising enough money to finance the gruelling training regime required to succeed in his oft-overlooked Olympic sport. And in this sport, finding potential investors can be tricky. The connotation of weapons is very harmful to a company's name and people do not understand what it is really about. It seems we live in a country that is afraid of the word weapon, so I could not find a sponsor for London 2012. The solution? Set up a website offering a range of gifts to anyone willing to help. Nearly 150 donors logged in and provided the 50,000 shekels needed to get through until the Olympics in July. There is a list of things that I gave in return for people's money, shirts, training, sessions with myself or my trainer, watching my training sessions, things like that, and people actually invest. I've discovered there are actually people who want to help Israeli athletes. Ironically, the country's top marksmen don't serve in combat military roles. Richter was labelled an outstanding athlete by the military and exempt from conscription so he could focus on his training. Coach Guy Starrick sees the potential. Sergei is one of the best 10 shooters in the world. In his age, he's the best in the world right now. And uh, it's the first Olympics, so I really, it's really hard to say how will he behave in, in the first Olympics. He overcame adversity and hit his target when it came to raising money. Who's to say Sergei Richter can't do the same in July at the London Olympics?